All right, let's talk about a uh, quick thinking seventh grader, and he is being honored as a hero, and his story captured national headlines. He safely stopped a school bus after the driver suddenly fell unconscious. Seven Action News reporter Simon Shekhet is in Warren tonight with a show of gratitude and support. Students on their way home from Carter Middle School last Wednesday witnessed something miraculous, and now a seventh grader who jumped into action is being recognized as a hero. As a seventh grader at Carter Middle School in Warren, Dylan Reeves knows it's not easy being a hero, but he did not hesitate to jump into action when his bus driver suddenly passed out. To Dylan Reeves, in recognition of your quick thinking and bravery. Today, both the governor's office, State Senator Paul Voino, and the school district awarding Dylan for his bravery in gently breaking to a stop and putting the bus into park before anyone got hurt. Talking with ABC, Dylan reflecting on the actions he took. I know when he first came home, he was like, all he did was stop the bus. Wasn't expecting anything out of it. No. He just. He didn't even think it would be on the news. It was not yeah. a big deal. Was just, I wasn't even thinking yeah. about that anymore. This is so good for him, you know, it, he needs to be recognized for that. We need more of this in the world, you know, we need to be cared for and take care of people and I'm sure there's more to come. Dylan's response, nothing short of remarkable as the bus was traveling on Masonic near Bunnert Road. Video showing Dylan stepping to the front and helping while yelling for others to call 911. What he did will grow in intensity over time uh, when you consider here he's stopping a 15,000 pound school bus with 60 five children on it and just cool, calm, quick thinking under pressure. Today the community also coming together to support a GoFundMe page for the driver recently released from the hospital but off the job during her recovery process. Fellow bus drivers sharing their emotions for what she's been going through. That money is going to help her while she recovers and is unable to drive. It's going to help with her mortgage, her groceries, all of the things that she needs to take care of with her three small children. Thanks to Dylan, police and fire were able to quickly catch up to the bus, render aid, get an ambulance for the driver, and get kids onto another bus. Through it all, Dylan remaining humble despite a wave of national attention. I think it's overwhelming for him, um, but at the same time, he's handling it very professionally and. Um, seems to still be him, his normal self. No surprise, Dylan tells us he's planning to pursue a career as either a police officer or firefighter. For more in Simon Shaykat, 7 Action News.